Hi, my name is Katie. I'm the assistant ranger at Aberton. I'm so excited to be taking part in the Essex Coastal Challenge this marine month. Today I am at Rabness, one of the most beautiful nature reserves in Essex, to talk to you about the recent extension project creating more wet grass and habitat for overwintering wildfowl and breeding birds. Through generous public donations, the Essex Wildlife Trust were able to purchase a further section of marshland previously used for horse grazing, aiming to provide an extension of wet grassland and create precious habitat for many rare species. The future goals include installing an internal fence along the central ditch to protect potential water vole habitat and allowing an area to be planted with sea hogs fennel to attract Fisher's estuarine moth. By providing areas such as this, we hope to open up wildlife corridors for this rare Essex moth and many other species, helping to restore the fragmented landscape. Wet grass and habitat, as described in the name, needs to be kept wet to be able to attract wading birds. Wading birds rely on the wet soil, muddy hollows and open pools for feeding up and rearing young chicks. The loss of wet grass and habitat in the UK has led to dramatic declines in wading birds such as curlew and lapwing. Here at Rabness, in order to extend the wet grass and habitat, scrapes and ditch plugging are in the pipeline to be done, as has been done successfully at other marsh reserves across the county. Thank you for joining me today at Rabness. All funds raised in the Essex Coastal Challenge goes to fund projects just like we've spoken about today. Now we want to hear from you. Let us know how your fundraising is going on social media at hashtag Essex Coastal Challenge, on our Facebook page at Essex Coastal Challenge Champions, or you can email us at fundraise at essexwt.org.uk. Together we can make a difference. 